Hello and welcome to episode 2 of my Let's Play of East 1 on the PC. In the last episode, um, a doll washed up on the shore at Barboza and essentially we, we recovered and we walked around town and we made it to Manea where we discovered that there is a fortune teller who wants to, to see us. But apparently we had to go and get like, geared up before we saw her. So, <laughs> her words, not mine. Well, maybe not exactly, but anyway, we're now going to go in and see her. So, let's see why she needed us to go and get some equipment. Oh, and a shield. Oh, okay. Um, I don't have enough money for that. Right. So, what I'm probably going to have to do, I'll see how much I do need for that. That was a bit of an anti-climax. I was assuming that I could spend my money as much as I could. Um, I'll double check. I th actually, I was say I never tried. Had in my head I didn't have enough money. No, I don't want to speak to you, sorry. Small shield's fine. 700, whoa. I'm guessing it's only more off than there, isn't it? Oh, I don't want to talk to you anymore. Cancel. No, oh, I can't skip the... I'm trying to do the jump to the top of the, top to the bottom. Um, ah! Damn it, menus. Right. I'll be back when I have cash. So... I guess what I've got to do now is go and level up a bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head down, hopefully I've got, I've got some gear. Um, I'm going to head down to where I was. So where I've got it configured, I believe, if I go to the option. Yeah, you can see it's the amount of the next level shown. If you switch around the top left there. So, well, I'm going to just go and level up, I guess. See how... Well, I'm not going to show all of it, because if I'm killing those things and I'm getting 2 XP a time, that's 100 of them I've got to kill. I'll just walk past the thing there. I know they keep respawning, so that's kind of cool, but um, see how we get on. With my newfound sword. Still take some beating. Um, I do have them equipped, don't I? Yeah. I'm just not very tough, it seems. So I'm going to heal a bit of my HP up again. Okay. Um, uh, I need so I need six hundred more to do this. Now, yeah, I'm gonna do this off screen. So, right, even if I moment, yeah, right. What I'm gonna go and do then? I'm just gonna save now so I don't lose like the will to live. Is to do that off screen. And I'll be back momentarily with hopefully some cash and all levels. So, catch you in a minute. Okay, I'm hopefully going to demonstrate one thing I've just realised out of my sort of playing around here. I've been kind of stifling myself a little bit. We're well, stifling myself, making it harder by using the analog stick. It seems that when you get, like, if you try to use the analog stick, you kind of struggle a little bit. Actually, that's going to work now, isn't it? To line them up, you just got to kind of charge at them. And what has been happening is I've been doing, like, not quite in a straight line. But if you go back to just using the old-fashioned um, up-down, like, you know, D-pad, it works a lot better. Um, I don't know, I just found that interesting. I thought I would show that off. Um, going to continue the fight, hopefully. The thing I found is that those blue devil guys, I just can't hurt anymore. Had a guy, oops, had a guy stuck up against the wall for about a minute like that and just wasn't doing any damage whatsoever, so... Probably not the best idea. Oops. Oh, ow! Don't die, don't die. Um, I'm just going to do this one and I've got some space. There we go. Right, so I will... Yeah, I'll keep going and I'll hopefully again be back when I've got at least level two. So, catch you in a minute. Okay, one other little thing that I've noticed, because apparently I'm not that observant, I need to equip stuff. So I bought the stuff before, but I haven't actually equipped it. So now I've got a sword in my hand <laughs> and a shield, I assume. So it's just I mean like now these guys are I wouldn't say trivial, but not far not far from it. Also it lists now my equipment. And also, also, hopefully, take those guys out. We should make this whole thing a lot quicker. We can find some more of them. I didn't actually see how many XP they gave us there, but I've got to guess it's more than two. So let's find another devil dude. Oops, that was a bad idea. 
Yeah. Um, oh, I wasn't watching again. Um, I'm not a failed servant. I think it was four or six. Let's go and have a look. Let's get my HP back up quickly. And so one, two, six I'm at at the moment. And yeah, so four. Not the end of the world, but it's twice as fast, so that's always good. Oops. Should get better at doing this though still. But don't do as much damage, so that's good. Um It does mean that the whole thing is significantly quicker though. Just kind of ploughing through these guys, particularly the oops, not if I do it like that, but the wood guys. Whatever they are. Let's get a last XP there. So HP back. Um so yeah, I shall oops. Well hopefully in less time than I was previously anticipating, if I'm not stupid about it, I, and I don't keep doing that. I'll be back this time. <laughs> the third time I'm saying so. Coming up towards level two. So catch you in a second. Okay, I'm down to 10 XP to go, so I'm just gonna play it on from here to level two. I've already got the cash now to get the shield, so. I think in terms of plot-wise, I'm pretty much like where I need to be. Um, just to buy, I'm just going to buy the shield, so then like Sarah or Sarah will talk to me, basically. Um, need to prove that I'm worthy and whatnot. But so let's see what see how much we level up. There we go. Whoa, thirty. That's doubled our strength, and I believe our defense has got another five as well. So. Yeah, that's gonna be going. It's gonna be pretty nice, isn't it? It's just one hit kill now. Yep. Um, oh, and another fifteen HP as well. Cool. Um, well, I'd almost say this kind of yep one hit kills. In fact, at this point, I can probably be a little bit blasé and just kind of plow into these guys. And that was probably offset. I'm gonna try. I swear, try and hit one of them square on. There's none up there, is there? Um, uh, one HP. What these guys? Yeah. So, there's like still time to practice technique, but... Not, like, doesn't really count for much. Also, the, the XP doesn't seem... It's still another 200 to the next one. So I'm like now... <laughs> tenth of the way to the next level. Um, but I'll stop doing that now. And we'll go and see Sarah. We'll get a shield, then we'll go and see Sarah. So... Round the outside of the Minea Byway. And into if it will let me there we go and let's find that's the pub I believe it's down here isn't it yeah let's go and get a shield alright I've got your blood money let's do it let's get a small shield yep 700 oh it's a good thing I remember that correctly that or it's gone up Um. Did that go up? I thought it was 600. My brain could also be addled though. Um, and let's equip with that as well. Cool. So, a bit of improved defense. There, nice shield on you there. Alright, my son, let's go and see the fortune teller. So now she might talk to us. So, good day, good day Mrs. Fortune Teller. Ah, we actually get a full on, like, what's I'm looking for? Like, cut so we talk to her. So thank you. Are you familiar with the Book of East? Um or Books of East? If I'm being honest, no. East was the name of an ancient kingdom that existed here ages ago. <laughs> it's not a technical term. <laughs> it's ages ago. Um, the lost history of the land is written within the Books of East. It is unknown, however, who actually inscribed their words. Hmm. But the six books detail the reason for East's fall from grace. My crystal ball tells me that one of the books is in the mountain shrine. Uh, <laughs> Game over. No. Um, yeah, sure. Ah, you are truly the man I've been seeking. Thank you so very, very much. Please take this with you. It'll show you the way within the shrine. Uh, let's get Sarah's crystal. Okay. First, please visit Jaber. In the village of Zepic. She is my aunt. She knows a great deal about the history of East. I'm certain she will be of aid to you. Zepic village is to the northeast, just outside Minea. You pass through it on the way to the shrine. Okay, well, that's it. We've got ourselves a job. 
Um, cool. Let's just put her on. I'm going to go and check that chick at the top. Oops, didn't mean to speak to him, but I did. Uh, he's at the pub. Um, do you need to know he's at the pub? No, okay. He, he, I've, I could have told you. You just don't want to listen to me, do you? Yeah, yeah, she's pretty. Um, okay, that's all you got. She's still here. Yeah, you just have money. Okay, right. I was hoping you might have some more crack because you had the whole, like, big picture come up. Big avatar, whatever. Right. I guess we just head forth. I'm going to... Let's do that, I guess. <laughs> Let's see what's about up here. So. Um, Repic Village. Oh, Vastin Village is closer, though. Hmm. Someone tells me this area is going to be a bit bigger, though. Uh, a bit more to do and see. Mostly these guys. Although, we've now pretty much got the measure of them, I think. Oops. Not if I do that, but yeah. That'll do. And... Ooh, I'm going to check XP again now. Are these... Did I get XP for getting that? F I must have done for accepting that quest. Wasn't paying attention, but... Oh, well, there you go. Right, um... But yeah, do I just head up here? I'm just going to... Just going to on-screen it for now and just fight some of these guys because it's, it's not like a long sort of trivial... Like, it's grinding, but it's not boringly grinding. I'm just trying to find out where I'm supposed to go, so this looks like it's... Well... Yeah, I'm going back on myself there. But, um... And there's blood everywhere. No, um... And, yeah, just keep going up here, I guess. So... Oh, there's still some of those guys who I still can't... I'm still haven't quite got the gist of it. I've turned the analogue... Like, you can... Actually, I should show this because I did it off-screen. What's that? Oh, it's crystal. Um, it was the options. You can turn that off being 360 degrees for the analogue onto 8-directional, which makes the analogue stick work like a D-pad. Because I've just got almost force of habit these days just using the D-pad for any sort of movement. So, yeah. Actually, one of these away from a level up. So let's see how much level up we do. Whoa, nice. Um, so, a moment. Well, yeah, that's another massive boost. There's no messing about here. Um, <coughs> so, oh, dogs are about now. Ow, that hurt quite a little bit actually. I'll still take the dogs out in one hit though. That's good. If you go across this way. What's down here? Oh! What was that? Um, don't know what that was. Just keep going. Because I'm not sure which way I'm at now. I feel like I'm going into a dead end-ish. I'm down a path rather than on a plane, per se. I would say those blue devil dudes seem to be dying quite effectively here. Oh, is it one of those little pickards? Yeah. They're delicious, so it's fine. So where am I going up here? Um more tree dudes. Or wooden dudes. Dogs. The dogs seem to be more angry. I'm not sure if they're actually tougher or not, but We're doing alright now though, generally. Oh! Road a tree Ah, right. Um What? That's... is that a glitch or is that just... I don't know what I'm supposed to do, what that was. Um... <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'll leave it. At least to know where the road tree now is if I need to find it. Um, which I assume I will actually because it's a place in the game. Seemed like a nice tree, but yeah. So, ooh, we've got a fence. What's this sign say? Raston Mine. Okay. So this probably isn't the way to go because we were told the mine was dangerous. So yeah. Tell you, what, I'm just gonna see. Let's 
let's have a look. Yeah, so we've got the mine in here. Yep, no, that's no damage at all. Let's get out of here. Um, yeah, I'll stick to one hit and kill these guys. Um, with the kick-ass guitar music. Yeah, come on. Right, so I'm guessing we're this way then? Maybe up here? They said it was past there. I've come back into the mine again. Yeah, it's back into the mine again. And I can't get up out that way, no. Okay, so maybe, maybe to the east? Not there, but... It's a bridge. To... There we go, right. Yeah, so North Zepic Village. Uh, so let's do that. Let's take out some more of these guys, though, while we're here. Ow. And there's another one. Just probably be a bit more careful with my attacking, but... There's nothing here that seems to be doing any significant damage, so I can be a little bit... Devil May Care, I suppose. I'm guessing it was back north again, actually, up here. It's just... Yeah, just getting that bit of HP back. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> That's better. Well, it's not. Um. Oh, ow. Can I get up and through here? Nope, that's just a road to nowhere. Um. Okay. Dog. God, I need to get that lining up sorted out. It's going to bite me in the backside at some point. Is that the way there? Right. Cool. So, we're at the new village. Zepic Village. Which sounds like it's not in the best of fettles. Um, hello there, chap. When I was young, I used to archive historical documents. One of them tells of two goddesses who saved the country from a great cataclysm. Um, well, yeah, that would be cool. We just sort of say, who hey, goddesses, sort us out. Ah, Jabo. So where is she? A lovelier country, eh? Ah, and they're talking about goddesses. Where's she at? Is she in here? You're not her. You're the mayor. Ah, from Barbado. Yes. Dr. Bluto, then. That's good. Good. Right. Yeah, sure. I can keep a secret. I've, I can't talk, so that's a start. Yeah. This village's charm of protection, the Silver Bell, has been stolen by thieves? Oh, crap. I'll negotiate them with my sword. Yeah, let's do that. The thieves' den is north of the village on the mountain road. If you meet their leader, please tell them I'll pay whatever price he asks for the bell. Oh, they're going to play a play a price. They're going to pay the toll. Oops. Oh, I know that she does. Damn it, Demi. Let's get my way. I need to find, find her. Is that her? She seems like a strange old woman. Hello. Ah, so that was Crystal, yes. Yeah? I do, yeah. Alright, so there's a key for the shrine. Very good. Um, Solomon Shrine. And if one of the books of East is in there, it will no doubt be somewhere in the shrine's lower levels. Virtually anything. Okay. Um, okay. I'm not overtly prepared, really. Um, what I shall do, though, is prepare... Well, I'll have my chat around here, basically. Right, so doing the Black Cape. Um, no, he's probably not good. He seemed evil. Corvo! That's a name I haven't heard in a while. Um, everyone hates the thieves, but their leader Goban is really a great man. Okay, so he might not be someone who I have to just slaughter. Um, Granny Lucia. If you ask me, it's trouble. So many elderly people here. We're sitting ducks if ghouls should come knocking. Oh, not ghouls. Oh, crap. Or does she, mean, does she just mean monsters in general? Oh, yeah, we spoke to you. Yeah. Let's have a look in here. So what's going on here? Minea's in a bad way. Thieves have been on a rampage there. Well, they're from up here. So... 
Ah, no. I was trying to get past you there. Let's walk around. You've been to the lakeshore. It's so pretty. Um, okay. I'll bear that in mind. Right. Uh, I think I bumped into that then. Right, um, well, there's no fruit. There was a... Oops, was that somebody at the bottom there? Was that the same? No, it must have been one of the people who was already there. Okay. Well, I guess my plan for now, then, is to head out north. Which... Basically, I am going to do in the next episode. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. Tomorrow we'll go and try and liberate the Silver Bell from the the thieves up on the path. Um, I'll first have to find them, but, yep, yeah, I'm sure that'll all be in due course. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed the episode. I'll be back with that um, soon. So, take care of yourself. Have a good day and goodbye.